So in this video tutorial, we will learn about a very simple simulation of ESP32. That is, we will just print some message on serial monitor. So how we can do that first? You can go to Google and you need to write vocv.com. It is an online simulator and you don't have any sort of need to install it out. So now we have opened it up. So now we will go and we will go and we will search for ESP32. Okay. So here we can search ESP32. Click on it. Now here you can see that we got our ESP32 here. And its coding window was, is on the a left hand side while the circuit window is on the right hand side okay so how we can do that first uh, we will go and we will analyze our wired setup okay and here you can see that there are two main things one is wired setup and one is wired loop wired setup obviously is an is a function okay these two functions are very necessary for uh, in order to work in Arduino IDE compiler. Okay, so wire setup will execute just for one time while while loop will execute again and again. Okay, so in wire setup, there usually there are initializations. So serial dot begin is our function uh, which will tell us about the board rate. So 11, so it is 11, 5, 200, okay? This is our baud rate. Baud rate on which we will communicate it with the serial port, okay? And serial.println, it will just print this method that is hello ESP32, okay? Okay, now this is wide, this is delay of 10. Uh, it means that we have a delay of 10 milliseconds, okay? Now we can write here serial dot dot print ln. Okay, uh, we can write uh, Nelson Darwin. Okay, and then okay, wait, let me it's Nelson Darwin. Okay, then we will write some more things like uh, uh, project one 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 project one one one. Okay, now or we can uh, increase the delay to one second that is equal to 1000 milliseconds. Okay, so here we can we can see that first it will write uh, serial.println function will write on serial monitor that is Nelson Darwin and then it will write uh, project 111. So let me run it out. Uh, it is taking a bit of time okay because it is an online simulator and obviously it is uh, I think that up to my opinion it is a little bit uh, good than Tinkercad okay okay so I'll run it out Okay, now you can see that it is again printing again and again. That is Nelson Darwin. Okay, and project 111. Okay, so in this way we can okay print any sort of serial uh, like uh, on every type of string data on serial monitor. So hopefully you got the concept. So thanks for visiting our channel and don't forget to subscribe.